The Drawing Manager in ARCHICAD is a tool that allows you to check the status of every drawing placed on your floor plan, elevations and most importantly in your layouts. You can access this tool by clicking on File, going to External Content and clicking on Drawing Manager. Another way to access this tool is to click on the Project Chooser and then select Show Drawing Manager. This tool, like all the other pellets in ARCHICAD, can be docked into any part of the interface. Or it can be left floating free. As you can see, it's divided up into several areas. You can see the various different columns. Each column has its own significance, of course. The first is the file type, and you can see a list of the different file types available. So you can see this is a DWG, a floor plan, a detail. Each one has the standard icons that you see all throughout ARCHICAD. In this case we have the ID next, name, status and more. If you want to see an additional field simply right click on one of the fields here and a list will become available. At this point you can choose any one of these options. For example scale. If you don't wish to see this, untick it and it will be removed from the end. If you choose that you want to see your pen set name, this will be added to the end of the list. Now we can list by pen set name. If at any stage you want to sort a particular column, just click on the column and it will automatically be sorted. Or if you click it again, it will ordered in the reverse order. In this case we're going to sort by status. Now I want negative sorting so just by clicking on it twice. As you can see there are many different statuses for the drawings that can be shown here. Unavailable is one of the options. This usually means that this drawing has been placed from an external file and that you've either changed the name or moved the file or that it's on a network drive that is no longer available. OK indicates that the file has been checked and it's up to date and it's OK. Needs checking means that the file has not been checked recently and therefore you probably want to check the status of this file. Modified means that the drawing has been checked and has been modified but it hasn't been updated on this page. Embedded means the file has been embedded inside the program therefore it cannot be updated. To check the status of a drawing simply highlight it by clicking on it or to check multiple drawings at the same time hold down control and click on all of the drawings that you want to check. Alternatively you can check the whole list by clicking on the first drawing that you want to check and holding control and then clicking on the top one that you want to check. In any case, you can select multiple drawings and check the status at the same time, simply by clicking Check Status. The moment you do this, it will update each one of the drawings. It will update each one of the drawings you have selected, or at least it will check the status of each drawing that you've selected. So over here we've got one drawing that's OK and two that have been modified. To update any of the drawings that have been noted as modified, I simply select it, go to the Update Drawings button and left mouse click on that. Once I do that, it will automatically update from external or internal drawings automatically. And now the status is obviously showing as OK. I might need to resort my status and you'll see now all of the files are now unavailable, OK or embedded. In some cases you may wish to unlink a drawing, for example this detail. The reason why you may want to unlink a drawing are uh, varied. In this case I'm going to unlink it because I never want this drawing updated again. So I'm basically taking a snapshot of this detail at this point in time. So first I'm going to highlight the detail, or any drawing of course, and click on break link button. If I do this it will warn me do I want to permanently break this link. If I do I click on break link. You can now see that this drawing has now become embedded which means I can no longer update it. 
If I do want to change this back again, I can't use the undo button. However, what I can do, highlight the drawing that's embedded, click on link drawing to, and I can choose where I want that drawing linked to. If I choose an external source, I can go look for a source on my hard drive, and then I can choose where I want to link it to. If I choose an external source, I can go and look for a source. I can go look for a file on my hard drive. By selecting an internal view, it will show me a list of all the views that I have available on the plan, and I can choose the matching view and push link. This drawing will now become linked again. If I have a drawing that's unavailable, because I may have moved the file to another location on my hard drive, I can go searching for that simply by clicking on link, link drawing to, then I can choose an external source, click on browse, and then go and find that drawing on the hard drive. Once you've located it, you simply click on open. In this case I no longer have this file so I won't be able to make it available. This one here however, if I click on link drawing to, choose an external source, click browse, and choose the matching drawing. In this case the site plan. I click on open and of course it wants to know the matching drawing unit in Archicad and then I push place. Immediately that drawing has updated. You can also delete drawings using the drawing manager. For example if I click on unfurnished house double click on the view to show me the layout that it's on then by clicking on the red cross, I can delete the drawing immediately. One thing to be wary of is that you can't undo that unless the layer is operational. So that it's very important to highlight the view first and then double click on the view. This will automatically zoom to the layout that it's placed on and then you can delete it. And because you've made sure that the layer was active, you can choose undo and the drawing will reappear.